so Henrik, we uh, in the last session we were talking, we kicked off this topic of uh, facilitation, mm -hmm. and now we are here in uh, part two of this little uh, little series of on facilitation. What are we going to talk about today? Another thing to do very early in the session is to help the team decide on what might actually be possible for the mm -hmm. session. Right. What is the purpose and what is the goal? Mm -hmm. But then also what is possible within this time limit that we have. Right. This we should do early, right? Yes. Yes, it's exactly it, it, establishing what is the best outcome. Best this. possible outcome. Yeah. Best possible outcome. Yeah. And then they might say, we want if you have decided this, then we are happy. Mm -hmm. So then we know what to aim for. Okay. Excellent. I think that's a good start. Okay. So then, yeah. And maybe help help the group visualize what what uh, be concrete. What what do we see? What do we feel? What do we hear at the end of the session? To be really happy. To be really yeah, happy. That's a good uh, technique. So okay. then it starts and we we'll work with different exercises maybe and discussions. And then the role of the facilitator would be to listen and think, uh, are we making good progress? Will we reach the goal? What, goal? what do you think? Right. Will we meet the purpose? Mm -hmm. But sometimes we may get the feeling like maybe the group starts. Sometimes I feel like, are they really talking about the subject now? Is, are they distracted? Mm. Uh, yeah, this may happen. Somebody, yeah. somebody talks about what appears to be yeah. a totally different subject. Yeah. Have you been in that situation in a meeting? Yeah, yeah for sure, all yeah. the time. Yeah. So what would you do then if somebody steers off track? Yeah, well you, you established earlier that it's okay to interrupt them, so go, just go right ahead and interrupt them. Yeah, uh, so maybe I'll stop it, get back on track. Well, that is an interruption. Yeah. Why isn't that the best way? Well, well it may be that you feel that this is not relevant, but it could also be that you misunderstood. There might be something mm -hmm. that, that somebody wants to bring up that is actually re relevant, so maybe a better way to do it. How would it sound like? Yeah, so uh, hang on for a second. Uh, can we just pause there? I wonder I wonder if this, uh, what we're talking about now, is uh, leading us towards the goal. What yeah. do you guys say? Yeah, so we'll leave it up to them, because they have the expertise in the area. Right. So and then they might say, they might say, yeah, it's a, this is actually a relevant topic because this and this. Mm -hmm. Or they might say, no, maybe this is not related to the. Yeah. And if they say now, what do you do then? There could there could be two different things that happen then. Maybe uh, uh, it could be like this is not related to the goal, but it is very important. Mm. So we should ask the the people in the session. So what do you think should we part this issue and do it later, mm -hmm. or do you want to? Do it now, but in that case, we will not be able to reach the uh, original goal. Mm -hmm. So we let them decide this also. And if we don't reach the original goal, then we open up to change the goal. Yeah, we have to change the goal or yeah. or yeah. park the subject. Mm -hmm. So those are some common techniques. Right. Yeah, nice. thank you. Thank Bye. you for watching. Bye.